Less than an hour, the gates to the Sevier County Fair will open for the first time this year. Yeah, it's in town through Labor Day. Emily DeVoe takes us to all the fun. Hey, Emily. Well, in just a few minutes here, the rides will crank up for the 84th annual Sevier County Fair. It's a great afternoon here despite some rain earlier today. Tammy's the marketing director for the fair. And aside from all the rides, you guys have a lot of fun we stuff. We do. Going. We have a lot going on this year. We have a lot of new events. We have tonight at 7 o'clock our first ever Farm Warrior Challenge. What's that? Oh, well, you don't have to be a farmer. We just need to know if you've got the skills of a farmer. Think Ninja Warrior, <laughs> that type of thing. But on the farm. So, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> on the farm. Uh, adult first prize is $100, and the kids' prize is 50 bucks for that for first prize. So. Yeah, we've got that Dolly Lookalike contest later this week. Lodge Cast Iron is doing a cast iron skillet toss for us. Just yeah. a lot of new stuff this year. If you're competitive, this is the fair for you. You've got a competition for everything. What a lot of eating competition. A lot of food. If you like food challenges, food eating contests, we've got a lot of that. Quaker Steak does our atomic wing eating contest, so we've got a lot of neat things for that. And they do a year's worth of wings for the prize for that one, so that's a great one. You hear that, food up for grabs, money up for grabs. You could just have a good old time here. And every year you guys have a different theme. This year's all about agriculture. Tell me about it that. It is, it is experience, a look back in time. Uh, we actually won state champion last year, and we are up for champions of champions this year, and we wanted to focus more on agriculture. So that's sort of the theme this year, and sort of look back at what, what it was like before. So. What is Champions of Champions? What kind of competition? Uh, well, you win at a state level in different divisions, and then the ones that win in those divisions go up against each other. So we're up against uh, some very large fairs and then some smaller fairs, too. So. All righty. Gates open at 5 o'clock tonight. It's $6 to get in. Um, and that was one of the things that we were talking about earlier. She was saying, you guys want this to be a fair that you pay the $6 and you get to do so much yes. on that money. Yes. The only thing you're going to pay extra for is the rides, of course. And if you eat, and there's a few airbrushed um, face painting type things you pay for. Parking is free. But once you come in, there's so many things that you don't have to pay for for your family to do. Gotcha. And if you guys are looking for something to do on Labor Day, they'll be open on Monday as well. We'll send it back to you guys.